Hi guys, um, this is quite a common problem with the Mac connecting to Western Digital, MyCloud or the, the other drives in the uh, Western Digital range where they sit on your network. Um, basically, when you try to go to them, this is a Western Digital MyCloud, you can see it's extremely slow and often I find it just will not connect at whatsoever. So what we do is we simply ignore that. We go up here and just go to connect to server. So that's on the go menu, connect to server right at the bottom. This is the IP address of it. Um, now, as you see, there's a bit of a delay there, but even this is quite a large MP4 file. This will crash out before it actually gets across there. But if you go direct to the server, you'll find that moving large files it's not a problem and it seems to run way faster. So let's just go, let's just go and mark. So like transferring this file here, just an example. Okay, mark's not available. Uh, let's try in Naples. That might be it because it's not a lot in there. But transferring the file, it's pretty quick as well in comparison to trying to do it through the MyCloud, the way they set it up as a second drive. Not sure why, but it's certainly a lot faster on transfers. I don't get it crashing out, and you'll find that life it makes life a lot easier. Now, the other thing is, how do you find where your drive is? I use this thing called IP Scanner, which is, um, th this version is a free download. You can get out the app store, and as you can see there, it says Western Digital. So that's telling me that's that IP address I put in there. Very simple, very straightforward, and just makes life so much easier. Because uh, I was sort of giving up on these drives, because uh, they work great on Windows, but Mac just seemed to be a bit tedious. All right, thanks for watching.